we're about to have a very interesting conversation. And this particular conversation is for you singles out there. I have on the couch with me right here, Isaac Odubeson. He is the founder of Very Singles Legotians and also the convener for Lagos Singles Festival. Yeah. How are you doing? Amazing. I'm excited to be here. Do people call you Mr. Single sometimes? No, the spiritual intercessor. <laughs> <is the word. laughs> That's spiritual intercessor. Intercessor of single people. I love it. I love it. I, when I heard about the festival yeah. um, recently, I was in awe. I'm yeah. not going to lie. Yeah. And I got very curious. I said, this is one festival that I would love to attend. And a colleague of mine was looking at me like, Don't but you're married. <laughs> and I'm like, I think it's just a curiosity because it sounds exciting. So talk yeah. to us about um, what inspired the idea. Okay, so it was, it was sometime around November in 2021. And it was just basic conversations with a couple of friends. And for us, we're just saying, why are so many people single in Lagos? What's the issue? What's the statistics though? I, I would check. <laughs> well, a lot of people are single. I are you single? Say, sometimes. Oh, okay. <laughs> so, but the idea is, I'm not, I'm not married. I mean, legally, I'm single, right? Okay. So, I'm not married, but of course. Yeah, so, so we, just, we just wanted to have conversations. And, and then we just said, okay, you know what? Let's have a talk show. And we did a talk show, and a bank sponsored us in December 2021. Nice. And we had like two, 300 people. And it was amazing. And they were like, you know what? It's time. Let's start something else. And we started to do games night. And then that made sense. The traction was growing. And then we did about nine games night. And then we said, well, let's do a festival in Landmark. And we had over a thousand people. Wow. And I was like, okay, it's time. Okay. <laughs> you know, like, let's, let's create something else. Let's create a dating app. Mm -hmm. And then we're, we're creating that right now. And then, okay, let's do digital product. You know, let's, let's go big. You know, but for us, we're centered around just creating an ecosystem for single people. Mm. I mean, we have our MDG goals also. We're trying to meet about 200,000 single people in the year 2025, make sure okay. that they have much mixed already oh. or they've been with each other already. Okay. You know, and like I always tell people, we've had two successful marriages. Is that the goal? Um, like every business, there's first the purpose goal okay. and there's also okay. the financial goal, okay. right? But the purpose goal, yes, is that, that people... Um, I mean, my friend would say you can't tell a good man what to do, but at least we, we try to curate, you know, an ecosystem for people to meet each other, mm. right? And some people end up in marriages, some people just friendships, some people just network, you know, but the idea is that, you know how you walk into a room, I walked into this place now, I don't know if you're married or not, you know, but... But I have a ring on my finger. But that's okay, I will check. <laughs> <laughs> okay. So, but the idea is that you walk into a space yeah. and then everybody there is supposed to be single. So mm. you can just easily just say, hi, what's mm. up? How are you doing? I mean, tech, I mean, you know, that kind of stuff. Now, let's talk about some of the conversations that, you know, that that's, you know, you guys will be having. Okay. You, I mean, you had your festival last month. Yeah. How was the response, first mm. off? What kind of conversations were had? Mm. And let's talk about the results. Okay. You know. Okay. So for us, the festival is a trifecta of speed dating, music, and games. Okay. Right? So we're able to, for us, and I'm big on experiences, mm. right? And yes, we had a couple of brands come support us and all. But what I'm big on is experiences. And what we did at the time was have people speed date, speak to people, um, 10 minutes switch, 10 minutes switch, oh. that kind of thing. Okay. And there was games and there was music, right? There was music from a couple of great people mm. that came. And for us, so it's just like you are there to meet, but also there to have fun. Mm. You know, so it's not it's not my talk show. It's not a festival festival. Mm. You know, we're having another one in December, by the way. Okay. And we have over we had over a thousand two people attend. A thousand two people. people. Yeah. On. This last that was the one, last this, one. Yeah. Wow. Good beach, yeah. Wow, interesting. You know, someone hearing about this festival would think it's a gathering for. Well. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know what that means. Okay. <laughs> Okay. <laughs> okay. So would you say this is a Christian gathering? No. So, I mean, I understand. Um, or a being, religious gathering. Yeah. So being in the singles, you know, business, yeah. it's something that you have to be somewhat delicate about. Exactly. Right? Because if you move too much to the left, you mm, become single, exactly. you become Christian. Mm. And if you move too much to the right, you become mm. hook up, yeah, right? Uh, but for us, we're at that intercession. Okay. Right? And for us... We, I always shout on my Instagram page that we don't want married people, we don't want this, we don't want that. So, but, I'm a Christian, but it doesn't mean that it's a Christian program. Mm -hmm. it's, just, it's, it's just in the middle, it's just meet at the level ground. But I promise you, it's, not, it's nothing like hook up, right? And, 
I mean, you could see from our trajectory, like, again, we're launching our app in November. Okay. We're building the first Nigerian dating app that helps, has people meet each other based on culinary options. Culinary options. options. You just go and meet in restaurants and eat. Ooh. Yeah. Okay. That's you know. pretty interesting. Yeah. yeah. Restaurant dating. Yeah. More like. Yeah. No chat button. Just go there directly. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Um, now let's talk about um, societal influence. Okay. You know, and, you know, the impact it would have in okay. the next, you know, few years. Okay. You know, let's talk about some of that. I mean, I always tell my team members that what we are doing actually, and I think that don't really should even make me ambassador or special of the advisor. youth Abby. for single people. <laughs> of single people. Because what we're doing actually okay. is that we're trying to reduce the rate of divorce. Yes, in Africa. Because we're going to Kenya, we're going to Canada, we're going to UK. Okay. It's happening. But in terms of societal influence, I'll be honest with you, right? Um, I think that this is somewhat the first singles, the only singles program right now going on in Africa. Yes, that I, it is. That I, have known I mean, of. I've never heard of anyone yeah. other than, you know, um, religious Christian, yeah. um, religious single fellowships. Yeah. I've never heard of this one of this magnitude. Yeah, yeah. So, I mean, for us, so, I mean, again, societal impact is that we have people with like minds coming to meet together, you know, and do stuff. And then also, we're helping a lot of single people and reduce the rate of divorce. Right, and what we also do is that so we're pushing the digital product, which is called Lagos Men Have Changed, to talk about somewhat so many issues that people shy away from, mm -hmm. right? So title, masculinity, all of those things. Mm -hmm. So it's for us is a journey and making sure that we can, you know, consolidate on all of this product, mm -hmm. you know, to make sure that you know people as they are partying, you're also learning, yeah, you know, to make and they're also going on dates. Yeah, I yeah. think it's very important because it's easy for it to be you know, um, labeled, mm. you know. Mm. And this is quite in interesting. Okay. It is insightful. I think it's very impactful as well. Okay. And um, it's very innovative. I love the idea, Lagos Singles Festival. Yeah, right. So we are having another one in December. December yes. And yes. I think it's one that, you know, we're looking forward to. Thank you so much, Thank Isaac, you. for doing Thank this you. with us Thank today. You. Thank you.